Welcome back to Pennsylvania Outdoor Life. You know, we announced a couple of weeks ago about a Toys for Tots tournament that was taking place in the Sunbury area. And it was being sponsored by the Melting Point Lures on and Montandon Bass. Well, that happened on July 22nd. Listen to this. So proud of these guys. They raised over $7,000 at the event. So the total for five years, 21,000. 390. They collected 297 toys. Five year total, 1,380 toys. And they had 61 boats. That's the most they've ever had in the history of the tournament. Their goal next year, to raise $7,500 and 300 toys and 65 boats. Good luck with that. Now, next year event's already been planned. It's July 20th. 2024 and the registration deadline is July 1st. Now get this, most tournaments raise money for Toys for Tots and all that kind of stuff, but one lucky winner, they gave away six spots, had money in it, but the winning team took home $1,500 in cash and a trip for two to Presque Isle Guide Service with Captain Ben Hines on Lake Erie. How cool is that? Now you remember we sort of got into this whole thing by fishing with Janelle Muser and Jason Ryder. They're a team, they fish in the Montana Bass Club and we spent a day with them on the Susquehanna River. We met 24 years ago. Uh, shortly, like in a five minute conversation, we realized we both like to hunt and fish and uh, we had that tradition in our families and we headed off and have been doing this stuff together ever since. I will be starting with a spinnerbait. That's my go-to, but um, so you announced Same. that yeah. we'll be yeah. selling those. Now you make them and sell those we're, as well? Yes, yeah, so this year we're gonna start offering our spinnerbaits, yep. So all I'm really trying to do is stay down below the surface a few inches. Um, I pretty much, we haven't fished for quite a few weeks ourselves. So I'm just looking to see how they react. Uh, if they come up and swat at it or if they actually commit and bite, then I'll just stay at that depth and that speed retrieve. Um, but primarily what I'm doing right now is I'm just probing to see where they're at. There's one, that's a better one. That's a good one. Average size for this? Or? That's a, a solid, a good solid fish. Um, we've been seeing what we noticed back when they were really spawning. It seems like the average is up compared to some years. And the tournament bags in the past couple years are looking like they're trending up. So, Not only are Jason Ryder and Janelle Muser engaged in tournament fishing partners, they own melting point lures together. So as you were growing up, as you were figuring out what you're doing for a living, did you ever think you'd own a bait company? No, not in a million years. <laughs> Do you help out? Tell me about that. Um, so he's basically the artist when it comes to creating and making the lures. He'll ask my opinion a couple times. Um, However, I do most of the marketing, the advertising, um, the, the Facebook page, the Instagram page, and wherever, word of mouth, I answer a lot of emails. And once he taught me how to use a bait caster, I've been hooked ever since. I don't, I'm not huge on finesse. I'll use it when I have to, but I like power fishing. Ripping lips. That's right. <laughs> Slinging blades. Jason and I used to set a bucket out and we would have our own little competition of who could cast into the bucket. And I couldn't tell you who won. I'm not sure. 
it helps when you're fishing the edges. I need to use a little heavier head. Oh, oh. <laughs> that was a good one. They just don't like me today. And that's how it goes. Some days he catches them all, some days I catch some. Not all, but. There we go. There you go. Look at that. Look at that. Oh. You got him? Yeah. Need the net? I shouldn't. You have a trailer hook on? No. I'm good. He's just a little guy. Come on. Mm -mm. Of course, right in that meat. There we go. It's a start. Do you see a lot of other women out there? No. Uh, the Thursday night Lunker Leagues, yeah. Uh, pretty much I'm about the only one that typically comes out for the weekend tournaments, the all-day tournaments. There's a couple, um, but I'm about the only one. How did you get started fishing? Um, my dad taking us out trout fishing and my yeah, uncles taking us out trout fishing. So what does it take, what do you look for in a, in a bass tournament partner, is it? You work together? Is it uh, uh, a little bit of camaraderie or is it poking and jabbing at each other? What makes the perfect partner? All the above. All the above. Um, it's if he's throwing one thing, I'm throwing the other. It rarely works that when you're throwing the same thing. Um, different colors, but you're looking for that support. If I'm having a bad day, he's there to pick me up and vice versa. But honestly, when we've done at our best, it's when we have both contributed to the bag that we're weighing in that day. There we go. That's another nice one. The net. Yeah, it's got some good weight to it too. Yeah. For a post spawner. I asked you before, what came first, the fishing lure or romance? It was romance, but <laughs> like I said, it didn't it didn't take us long to know that this is what we were gonna be doing together, and we're both very fortunate. Oh, yes. a girl. That's a good one. Come on to the front. Stay connected. It feels good. Good enough to hurt the ribs. Yeah. That's a good one. Trying to get him to come around. The boat's not cooperating. He is not. Come on. Ooh, he's a nice one, you know. That's a beautiful fish. Come on. Come on. No, 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 no. No. Nice job. All right, so that's a tournament winner, I think. That's what you can get when you get, don't get tail ended them all day. Right, <laughs> right, yeah. Great. Congratulations. Nice Thanks, fish. guys. Thanks. It's about time. Whew. Once again, Janelle and Jason, thank you for spending the time with us. You know, their lures look really good too. You may want to check those out. And of course, we're going to take a short break, but when we come back, we're going to talk about yet another Toys for Tots fishing derby. So stick around. <laughs>